What's up, everyone? It's Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Bowling Green versus New Mexico State college football matchup going down Monday, December 26, 2022. Before we get to that free pick, gotta let you guys know at PickDogs.com. We're doing it bigger and better than anyone else. Got more free pick videos on our channel than you'll find anywhere else on YouTube. So make sure you're subscribed and also take advantage of our free sportsbook bonus offer. The link in the description of this video below. Also in the description of this video below, click the join button for more information on our YouTube VIP and premium passes. Great way to get yourself some premium content for an awesome price. Those VIP and premium passes will ensure that every single day you're getting plays from myself, Mitch, and Rod. It's one of the best values going in sports handicapping today, so make sure it's something that you check out, take advantage of, and keep in your back pocket. But let's get to this one. Between the uh, New Mexico State Aggies and the Bowling Green Falcons, a pair of 6-6 six and six teams going at it in this one, as uh, obviously Bowling Green representing the MAC and New Mexico State, an independent, and... New Mexico State, you know, they they were going to get their uh, they were going to get approval for a bowl game even if they had five wins because they did have a postponement uh, on their schedule in in I believe it was against the San Jose State Spartans in that tragedy that happened mid season, but uh, still the the the. The, the Aggies, they had, you know, their, their waiver um, application approved, so they were going to, you know, get a bowl game even if they had five wins, but they went out and got six over a subdivision opponent to close out the year by uh, routing Valparaiso. And this is a, a New Mexico State team that looked pretty good down the stretch, you know, winning five of their last six games. The one standout game, their big road win in routing Liberty as 24-point underdogs, winning that game by 35 points in one of the biggest sort of against the spread swings I think you'll ever see and difference between, you know, the actual closing line and the margin of victory against the spread. But then you got to kind of look at who else they played in that stretch. They beat New Mexico, who was not a very good team this year, and the Mountain West was a down conference this year. They beat UMass, you know, again, a UMass team that is really not much of anything. A win over Lamar, and then that win over Valparaiso for five of, five of their last... Uh, Six wins down the stretch. And uh, they also had the win over Hawaii uh, at home. So, again, how much can you really trust the Aggies, to be honest? But Bowling Green, on the other hand, this is a Bowling Green team that I will admit I, I, I had my doubts about. But they've done a good job turning this program around. A team that was a laughing stock of the MAC in the COVID season that went 0-5. I think they were getting blown out by like 40 points a game. But Matt McDonald, you know, he's taken the right the steps to... You know, bring this uh, bring this Bowling Green program back to some sort of relevance here, as he uh, he threw for t over twenty six hundred yards, twenty six touch sorry twenty one touchdowns, eight interceptions on sixty one point two percent completion percentage this season, and for me, you know, the Bowling Green Falcons they had their ups and downs like I was saying, but you know they got a win over Toledo on the road as fifteen point underdogs late in the season. They had some quality wins you know over teams like Central Michigan, like Miami Ohio, both as underdogs. And obviously, if that's the case, you'd like to get Bowling Green, in, you know, in an underdog spot. But again, they're 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 to an expected underdog in conference play. They're not going to be an underdog here. But the fact is that I think that we're getting, you know, only having to lay three and a half points with the with the Bowling Green Falcons, is a gift in and of itself. The Bowling Green Falcons are just a far better team here. And while I will give the Aggies credit under Jerry Kill for you know a solid showing and reaching a bowl game this season. The level of competition is just is just leaps and bounds in favor of Bowling Green here. And I think the Bowling Green Falcons win this one by at least a touchdown. I'm going to lay the points here with Bowling Green. That's going to be my free pick. But if you're looking for best bets for myself or any of our other world-class handicappers, check out Pick Dogs Premium and use the promo code PICK, P-I-C-K, all one word, all lowercase, for 15% off your purchase of $25 or more at Pick Dogs Premium. And while you're at Pick Dogs, make sure you check out our free betting tools, some of the best betting tools in the business and tools that you'll want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like. Let's cash some winners.